Good morning. It is 9.20. Pretty late for today and it has been a crazy 24 hours, which I'm just going to tell you pretty briefly. Ended up, uh, like in yesterday's clips, went to Glasgow. That was actually really great. Got some trail magic that some people paid for our pizza, which was really sweet and nice. Uh, very like unexpected. And then we resupplied. We did charge of our battery, which is one of the bigger reasons why we wanted to go into Glasgow. And the shelter there was really awesome. And right when we were about to leave, we ended up running into Omega and uh, Monson. Um, and both of them have gotten chill names since we had like uh, last seen them. We hadn't seen them in a long time. So that was pretty fun. And just caught up with them for like an hour or two, all at the shelter hanging out. And then got a pretty easy hitch going back to the trail. And we just hung out under the bridge and just relaxed a little bit and we're enjoying. And we ended up camping like only like less than a mile, like point, point like two or something from the road and went to bed. And this is where it gets a little interesting. So woke up this morning, um, Snake Farm went to grab his bear bag. He's like, where's yours? I was like, oh, I just like put it up. Uh, up trail a little bit, um, or my ursac anyway, uh, cause I was kind of lazy. And so then I go to look for it and I don't see it. So, uh, we ended up spending quite a bit of time looking around and long story short, we think someone just took it, <laughs> which sounds kind of weird. Like, why are you taking these streets? But um, I don't know if someone thought it was like trash. It was obviously visible. So someone was curious. And like connecting the dots a little bit too. Like Snake Farm and I didn't sleep all that great. We were kind of like by the water. And somebody was hiking through around like 1.30 a.m. Um, I just remember because I heard them. I saw their shadow and I was like, that's really weird. And then uh, Snake Farm checked his watch because he was uh, grabbing his water too. So we're like, that's weird. Why is someone hiking that late? And so, I don't know. I'm pretty sure that was the person that took it. And they got the resupply, the ursac, which is like the biggest bummer, and the jet boil too, which the jet boil we're having issues with still. Um, we've had it quite a few years, but it's just still a bummer. So then we tried to hitch into Glasgow uh, to get more food and so that I could order, you know, whatever things I need, like an ursac or get a new bag and jet boil. So that took about 30 to 40 minutes. Ended up knocking hitch. Today is Easter, so not a lot of people out and a lot of stores are still not open. So yeah, that's kind of the story. We ended up just coming back to the trail. We're splitting Snake Farms food and we're gonna go to Buena Vista resupply and I'll order everything from there. But. Yeah, that is a story, definitely a bummer, but I have a super late pack now. And uh, yeah, lesson learned. Um, if you're close to a road, make sure that you are definitely, you know, keeping all your stuff. You have to hang like a bear bag, you can't have your food, but um, just making sure it's like in the woods, out of the way um, from anyone on the trail that could see it. So bummer, but uh, we're gonna keep continuing on. Beautiful iris is in bloom though. John's Hollow Shelter, empty. Very nice view. Ah, Snake Farm and I were just laughing. We're like, we have like no food. We're just talking about what we have to get. 
that we have to order, but uh, thankfully we have some snacks. Pretty sweet. Right, right here. Uh, we're hiking the AT. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Thank you. Punchable shelter. Hmm. And the water source is just over there. We made it to mile 800. Woo! 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 All right, 800 miles. How do you feel, champ? Uh, this last 100 miles has really beaten me up, I gotta say. It's taken a long time since we were at Dragon's Tooth. Yeah, it's definitely been tough. But that's okay, it's coming together. One footstep after the other.
Seven ten now, we've made it to the road, 22 miles. Now we're going to hitch and it looks like there's a cooler here. So hopefully a uh, treat would be nice. All right, let's see, snake farm opening up. Once you get all your stuff together. All right, drum roll please. Do, 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 Ooh, Gatorades. Oh, yeah. oh heck yes. And a Coke? I'll take a Coke.